Hey, good morning, homesteaders. Just a quick Monday update. Hey, look at my birds. Well, spent a lot of time getting the backyard cleaned up yesterday. We got a lot more work to do. A couple of raised beds put in. Put the tent up just so we could get it aired out for camping. There's the 500 gallon tank. We actually ended up dismantling the gravity flow system because barometric pressure or something reduced the flow so badly that it took two and a half hours for a cycle to complete at about midnight, which was just absolutely horrible. So we put it back to the way it was and I'm gonna get an auxiliary pump and we'll play with it some more. But let's take you inside the greenhouse. Of course, still don't have any fish. I worked all weekend trying to get the yard cleaned up. But this is nifty. We got these planted the other day and they're doing amazing. Just a little deep water hydroponics experiment. It's still water, it's you know not oxygenated. A little bit of nutrient in it, but I'm impressed. And of course, everything in the beds is doing wonderfully. Well, check out the, the, the drop seated bed. It is absolutely just gorgeous. All sorts of stuff is growing lettuce, onions, peppers, tomatoes, some grass right there. And of course, the blue kale bed. And I planted these peppers the other day. They're doing wonderfully. And the strawberries, of course. And there's some eggplant getting ready to be put in this, uh, uh, bed number three over here. We're gonna put eggplant over here and see what happens. So I probably won't be planting any tomatoes directly in the greenhouse this year because they kind of overran the entire greenhouse. If you looked at the pictures from last year, so. Let's go look at the front yard. Like I said, we have, still have some mess to clean up, but that's the fun of it. And what do we have here? We have five planted rows. We have some okra, some kale, carrots, radish, and I'm not sure what my son put in this one because it's not labeled. So, it's warm enough, the ground temperature is warm enough, and it looks like we're going to get warm enough days to where nothing will frost over. And I do have a giant piece of uh, clear plastic to put over this entire area, just in case. And then we're going to start working on the fence. We're going to put a fence up around the whole front here. So... That's just a quick morning update. Have a great Monday.